I'm now in front of uh, Skill 3, the Manufacturing Team Challenge, where we've got Ben, Michael and Matthew hard at work. And I, I've got to say the Manufacturing Team Challenge is probably one of my favourite categories here at an international competition, simply because you know, it, it's, it is a team event and I think so much work that we do in today's world is very much based on teamwork. You don't work in isolation, you do work as part of a team. And this category really showcases that. Three different skill sets all working towards the end goal, which in this case is to build the Australian Mini Moto. So come day four, hopefully we'll see the guys complete the laps on their electric scooter and come out on front. Here I am in front of Skill 43, Sheet Metal Technology, and Russell Rutledge, our Skilleroo, really getting stuck into it now. You can start to see the project coming together, as we will see with everything over day two. And I'm sure even towards the end of day two, you get a real sense of what their completed project is going to look like. Skill 19 Industrial Control, where our skilleroo is David McPherson, another one of the Ballarat contingents. So Ballarat are very well represented here in London. And behind me is Andrew Arthur, who's our expert in this category. Unfortunately, Andy's busy doing his job, so he can't speak to us at the moment. But it's great having people like Andy come back. I mean, Andy competed only two years ago in Calgary, in Canada, in the uh, Manufacturing Team Challenge category. And I think that's one thing that really sets the Australian team apart is that we do have so many past competitors who come back as experts. In fact, I think 15 out of this team of 26 have all competed in an international competition, which, you know, is great from the point of view that they can share their knowledge and experience.